What's going on, everybody? Derek Jackson. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? No, nah, man. No, no, no. No, no, no it's just, it's just welcome to Abba's field trip. Well, if you aren't aware who team, uh, Derek Jackson is, I almost said Team Jackson. <laughs> team Jackson, that's what you're... <laughs> team Jackson, what's happening? Uh, <laughs> fuck. Uh, he's a dating coach uh, who basically spent most of his career uh, shitting on black men and then constantly uplifting black women through that process. Basically brown nosing. Um, afterwards, a lot of men were like, watch out, ladies, this is a scam <coughs> artist. Turns out, uh, you know, he was cheating on his wife the entire time, cheated with multiple women, came out with a lame-ass apology, but he, now they're trying to work it out. At least that's what's been the case for the last year. And uh, recently, he announced his divorce after he got caught cheating again. And that's the thing, is that... Yeah, it, just, this, so, just so everyone's clear. He is, so be clear. The timeline is clear. Yeah. A couple blocks picked it up and said, hey, Jack, we found out you cheating. Again, and my man came on Instagram the next day and said, "Listen, it's very difficult to announce the fact that me and my wife are separating after." None of this shit matters, and we shouldn't care. It, it, it doesn't matter until you scold motherfuckers because they're doing the same thing you're doing. True. When you putting yourself in a position where you're saying you're doing this and you're wrong, you're doing this and you're wrong, you're doing this and you're wrong, you're a scam artist. Hypocrisy. There you go. That's the shit. From a man. <laughs> Who mirrors what I actually want a man to do? Somebody like Derek Jackson. Like Derek Jackson is always somebody. Mm, he was always somebody that I liked simply because I knew he was a married black man to a black woman. Like he is a black man who looks the fuck good. He's married to a black woman who looks the fuck good. He is faithful to that black woman. I, I just know that based on, because I, I've had conversations with him outside of that, outside of this, outside of the internet. I mean, that was your field trip. That was. I think all the guys got to sit back, kick up their legs, let the ladies process all this. You know, we, we, I, ladies, you might be done processing. No, you're not. You're going to keep processing because we had to endure him for many years. You're going to have to process for just as many while we just go. We told you so. So let's enjoy this. Okay. We're not done. So yeah, I messaged Derek. You was, messaged Derek. I messaged Derek. After all these years. I, I mean, I got so excited by this news. I had to just let him know how I felt. Tell your sh- No, not the top. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you, you piece of shit. You fucking piece of shit. This <laughs> oh, you hot ass, petty ass. Trash ass mess. You. Oh. <laughs> you. Oh, you cold. Oh, I'm. I'm. I'm actually jealous. I didn't do it. <laughs> he wrote, "Black man, don't cheat." <laughs> Get off me. Get off me. <laughs> Team Jackson, what's happening? Team Jackson, what's happening? Team Jackson, what's happening? Team Jackson, what's happening? <laughs> That's what, that, that's what I, listen, when I'm saying to you uh-huh. that you took a whole ass field trip with that shit, mm-hmm. we're, we're seeing the, look at the trees, look at the animal, oh look, that's a baboon, that's you. Again, heal together without hurting each other. My new book is available now at the link down in the caption. And by the way, I'm gonna speak in third person. How a man treats you is how he feels about you. I just had to co-sign that, bro. Like, that's some of the realest shit I've ever heard. Or if he treats you like you a dummy, that's how he feels about you. But you know, I'm tired of seeing y'all settle for these lames and these scrubs that treat y'all like shit. And it wild that Jared Jackson was telling on the man that he was himself the entire time. Action Jackson. <sighs> Team Jackson. Abba. You never miss. Can't keep it in his dick. What? Pants Jack. <laughs> Can't keep it in his dick. True. About it. He, this whole time, writing books, a cheating man's heart. Do you know how many books this man has? No. We've got a Four. cheating man's heart, mm. part one. Cheating man's heart, part two. two. A cheating man's heart, part three. Nigga, I'm a cheating man. What's up? Like, you know, that's part four. But anyways, all we need to know is this guy got a lot of books. He's not done. I still deserve it. And by it, he means anybody who's not his wife's pussy. Okay. I've come too far. <laughs> You can't make this up. Flag on the play. <laughs> I still want it. He's talking about that side pussy. Okay, I don't want that. that was a... Single mothers are for grown men only. 
You know he slid in somebody's with him and said that shit before he fucked her. Like, uh, yeah, these are crazy. Oh, this is my favorite one. This is crazy. Hey, quit. Don't forget your crown. <sighs> Don't forget your crown. Don't forget your crown. Don't forget your crown. Queen. Don't forget your crown. <sighs> hey, yo, ma. Yo, ma. You drop some. Yo, don't forget your crown. <laughs> oh, you're not going to respond? Okay, queen. Have a blessed day. Heal together without hurting each other. Well, I guess that didn't work. My nigga's getting divorced. When it's dudes out here who are really going hard for their girl. Again, don't forget your crown where I go way more in depth about how to avoid the guys that are actually trash. Y'all settling and fighting over these dudes that make you feel like you're just a runner up with these other chicks. When in the beginning, he was telling you that you was the baddest, you was the realest, you was the best, you was wifey, you was this, that, and the other. But then when y'all get together, he gets inconsistent and starts making you feel like you average. And you, if you ever have questions about how a man feels about you, ask his actions. That's gonna tell you everything you need to know. Heal together without hurting each other is actually half off right now at the link down in the caption. But if a dude don't fuck with you, shit, he'll ignore you, he'll cuss you out, call you out your name, he'll cheat on you, even put his hands on you. The last thing a dude is not gonna do if he's really into you is make it seem to other girls like he's still on the market. Even if there's no title yet, it ain't gonna happen. So if you're dealing with confused men, don't act confused whenever he leaves you heartbroken and your time wasted, because that's what confused men do. Put it like this. If the infractions are starting to straight up humiliate you, it's time to let him go. But the truth is, and I'm saying it here now, is that Derek Jackson was involved with other women. Cheating, affair. Do you remember when he was speaking in third person? Yeah. Good Lord. You know what? I don't even think I could really enjoy this that much. I think I've already enjoyed it as much as I could. I... At this point, I'm just like, what you feel for him? No, <laughs> no. You know what it's like? What is I like? figured it out. It's like when you pull up a porno, then you bust a nut, and then you sit there with your dick in your hands, and you're like, bro, why did I do this? Like, this, why is my dick still in my hands five minutes later? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Like it's over. Clean up, nigga. Let's go. Like, that's what I'm thinking to myself right now. Like, it's over. Hey. Healed Together Without Hurting Each Other, my new book, is available now at the link down in the caption. But let me say this. I have no sympathy for a man who finds it to be difficult to be faithful after being in a promiscuous lifestyle. And neither should you. Nobody told you to be promiscuous before the relationship. And nobody made you be monogamous with just her. You don't want her? Let another man have her. Now, if you're wondering what's going on with the wife... Uh, she's lost her mind. No. Really? Every person speaking against the names Danaya Jackson and Derek Jackson in mockery, accusation, slanders, and lies, may the mercies of God be withdrawn from you. May your husbands and wives become widows. Let your children become fatherless. Let your seed become vagabonds on the earth earth let the words of your mouth and your words of your hands be returned back to you let it go down your throat and choke you slowly until your days become few on the earth the word of god says touch not my anointed and do my prophets no harm you've been warned and if you want to know where that is at in the bible go to psalm 109 Go to Psalm 35, go to Psalm 140, go to Psalm 141 and keep our names out of your mouth in the name of Jesus. No, 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 <laughs> no, 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 you can't do, you can't, you can't, no, you can't do slavery in the name of Jesus. You can't kill in the name of Jesus. You can't do threats like that in the name of Jesus. Oh, you Making it in the name of Jesus don't make it good. All right. It's you still, you, wow. No. All right. You know what I mean? You can and she did. Wow. Shut Using up. the scriptures. Ex wow. But no, no, but she was, she was she was like that. I don't think she she was like that before. I don't know. This shit looked like it broke her. Me, me, she, me, me, remember, her to, remember when she was like dressed and all that? What, the, the helmet the, the, of salvation? The, 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 yeah, well, that, that was that. The helmet of salvation happened after the cheating. Yes, but that, ha that, that was that. But, I mean, this is the next level. Mm. I mean, she wishing death on people. Oh, yeah. 
That's another level. Yeah. And with that being said, you know, if, if he's only built to excel in the playground, he's going to do a whole lot better with the monkey bars and the swings and, you know, the merry-go-round than he's going to do with a woman like you who's built on business, who's built on breaking generational curses of continued dysfunction, who's built on building a, a, a empire and legacy. You can't do that with somebody who can only excel when it's play-play time. I play-play. Pause. I never tell them to halt. Stop. Cause I drop and roll with the truth. Hot. They call me in these streets sizzling. Like who? Sizzler. Boom. Boom. Shalaka laka. Boom. <laughs> Hey, 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 my nigga, that was a good assist. I got, I have to. Hey, hey, hey. And then hey, you have to. Hey, hey. He said, Shalaka, Shalaka, Laka. <laughs> Shalaka, Laka. <laughs> okay. Nah, nigga, I Hi, play, boy. play the say, say. Mm. My mom said, What did you say, say? I said, <gasps> I ain't trying to get no beating, though. Oh, goddamn. Swerve. She said, You gonna get that beating, though. Ooh, ooh. And I'm like, damn, ma, I just wanted to play, play. But you know what they say, say. What they say, say. Never mess with my ma because today's her day, day. Mm. I came for the fans. Ooh, came for him. Battle reps. Let's go. I came with some hams. Okay. Thanksgiving. Yes, go. We here with some lambs. Listen. But we ain't getting slaughtered. Look. Hey, boy. Mm-hmm. You know what time it is? What time is it? Play, play. Oh. God damn, that was hot. That made no sense. That made it not. That was hot. That was, that was hot. All right, there's a trip down a little memory lane. Okay? <laughs> Cause this has been an ongoing saga, you know. Oh, you, my you watch, this is a victory lap and an extra. So here's the more serious side, I guess. Yeah, go ahead. From my perspective, I don't think there's anything wrong with a man wanting to uplift women and to spend a lot of time on that or make that their mission. I just think it looks very suspicious to me. When you are extremely uncharitable to men and you're extremely charitable to women, like you don't understand the male perspective, then I just think you're brown nosing. I think you're You know, every time he describes a woman, he's like, when you're built on the idea of breaking generational, generational wealth while he's on the swinging from the monkey bars like a little child, it's like, why is it always these two extremes where it's like this boss, independent, Beyonce type woman, and then the dude is some loser with his bands below his knees and like three murder raps or what? Like, why is that always the example you go with? He's selling books. He's selling books. And this, I don't even think he believes what he says. I agree. I, I was going to say, if somebody has a financial interest yeah. in selling you products, oh, that's so why that you you're believe, saying it's sus. Yeah, yeah, I see you. Just be careful. I see what you're saying. Just be careful. Uh -huh. Okay? I, listening to his videos, I'm like, bro, he's doing too much. This dude, this dude, Brown Nelson. You know, this dude, Brown Nelson, a little bit too hard. So I've been a little bit sus of him. Um, and then with all this scandal stuff, it was just, that was just, thou doth protest too much. Which is just are you, like, are you quoting the scriptures too? No, that's Shakespeare. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, God damn. Which is just to say like, you're doing too much. You're doing too much. What are you really hiding? All this extra, extra. It's like, you're doing too much. The ladies like it because it reaffirms what they really want to believe on the inside. But is it the truth? Or does it work? I'm just saying. That's all I'm trying to get at, you know, and with all this... It works to, stuff, it, do I really care? Right. Not really. You know what I mean? At the end of the day, we can all sit here and laugh about it. But a divorce means a family's breaking up. Mm. means that children are going to have to deal with certain things. Mm. And he's got multiple children. There's nothing to be happy about, you know. Um, and I don't wish that on any family in that regard. Nor do I wish it on any marriage. So I sit back and I look at this. And I'm just like, Breff, you didn't have to do all this. I get you want to make some money. I get you got an audience you want to appeal to. I'm sure you would have retained many of them if you were more reasonable. Instead, you had to pretend and put on this fake persona. And guess what? When it turns out you are the perfect man that you pretended to be, the, inter the internet's going to come for that ass. Oh, they're going to come for you. And they will not stop. They will not miss either. You are officially a meme. But you know what? I don't even think this hurts them that badly. You want to know why? No, because motherfuckers are going to talk about this too. Because a lot of people want to hear the lies. They want to be told 
these lies because it makes them feel good. So this is going to blow over and he's going to go back to making his cheesy fucking videos where he's warning women about men who are him. And the world's going to keep pushing. I mean, listen, it looks exponential. For people who follow her social media, the stuff that she's been posting, you can tell that she's angry. She's lashing out at everything. Mm. It don't seem like she's doing great, my nigga. No, I don't think she is. But the, 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 whatever. I mean, hey, okay, let, let's say the mental health that was there before. You put a girl through these kind of dramas and things like that in the public eye. A sane person will have breakdowns over shit yeah. like this. Yeah. Now, somebody who got issues, mm. she out here casting spells, mm. wishing death on people. Yeah. That's not small. In the name of Jesus. Hey. And again, you know, the thing hey. Is, that's the thing. Is that hey. we're, 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 like, that's the thing. We all broken and shit. We all got shit to deal with. We all have our issues and stuff like that. It's just that like whenever you're trying to scold motherfuckers for your thing that you doing it, that's, that's, that's weird. Whatever. Yeah, yeah, but that's it. So I know everybody wanted us to do like 30 victory laps. I don't, I don't have it in me, to be honest with you. Like I said, I've been over this one. I had my fun back then. So at this point, this is just... Oh, and you have fun. Yeah, at this we point, enjoyed this is just, it. This is just thing that yeah. that was about to happen. It's all right. He is, he is what he is. And there's plenty of more like these. You know what is a real discussion? What is a real discussion? Bruv, relationship, these, gurus, these, re- relationship gurus need to go. All those gurus need to go. Relationship, zero certification, just talking out their ass on a mic, okay? And then trying to sell you products afterwards. Yep. I don't care if they just got to pay you one thing. Motherfuckers selling you products, convincing you that they're experts, like literally self-defining themselves as such. Yeah. That's a little weird. Same thing online. You can have an opinion. That's a different thing, right? I think that every time you dip your foot... Toe in the water. That's what causes toe cancer. Same, okay, that's an opinion. Same thing. Same but thing. I ain't a doctor. There's a difference. Joe Schmo saying some bullshit is not the same as a doctor saying. You call yourself an expert. Same, same thing with life coaches. There's too much of life coaches out there talking about know what you need. Shut the fuck up. Uh, yeah, and and, and then even in relationship, like <laughs> you don't know what, what goes on in real life. You don't know. Okay, that's one thing. The second thing is what works for one person doesn't necessarily work for other people. That's it. Like there's not there's not a key. There's not one key. Nope. There's tools but not keys. Ah, oh, yeah. In this book, there's a perfect. Nah. No, there. No, there isn't. Yeah. Stop. Anyways. Hey, listen, listen. Just careful. Relationship gurus are like these all crypto experts. Coming to find out a little while later, they're just a giant frauds. And they going to jail now. You see what's going on in... in they going to jail you now. You see, okay, you see what's going they on going right now. They going to jail now. You see what's going on in the crypto. Yay. Yay. There's a lot of frauds out here. A lot of motherfuckers was in my DM talking about, yeah, you want to learn about this shit and that shit and that shit, whatever. And I'm like, yo, where, <laughs> where you at now? What should be the criteria Of what? To be a relationship guru. No, 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 no. Let's let's pontificate. Because there's too much, there's too many parameters, parameters, there's too many parameters within a relationship. The different type of people that you're going to meet, A, the the other different type of people that's going to meet, B, so you got two different type of people that had to, there's too much, there's too much, there's too much. You talk just, just if you talk about a binary relationship, like a cis relationship, okay? You have the girl, all the type of girls, of different girls, with all the different type of issues that they might have, with all the different type of backgrounds. Then you have guys. You know what? You know what you need to, to be to be a, 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 good, a good guru, a psychologist. You need to do seven fucking years of of, of psychology and become a uh, therapist, a psychologist in in uh, relationship. That know. that are and even then, and even then they can be wrong. So a normal Joe that don't have the credentials, that have never been to school, that doesn't study psychology, that just goes on whims of life. Yeah, no, no, no. I'm We're not, not doing that. You, I mean, you said you know you have to be in order to be fit to be a relationship guru. And in my head, I was thinking, God. I think that's the only person. Really, God. I think God. God. God knows your heart. Yeah, the one that went inside a relationship and impregnated Mary, made him a virgin, and had Joseph the, Joseph the cuck. That's, just... that's your God. No, that's not my God. That's their God. Yeah, no, that's, that's some folks' God. And that's your yeah. God. That's the one you grew up with. That's not mine. Okay. Mine didn't do that. Okay, so you're your God? You claim your God? Yeah. I thought, I thought yeah, she was mine. not. Oh, shit. Talking yeah. about yeah, my, my God. 